Welcome back to um, Outer Worlds. Um, it's been a while since I've played this, and to be quite honest, I am unsure how far I am. Um, only because, like, so I was also playing the game my own time. And so I have, like, multiple saves, and I don't quite know which one this is. I can't get into here because I don't have enough. Wait, what does that say? Geothermal Security Chief's key card. Okay. I might be able to find this man's key card. Yeah, like, I genuinely don't remember what the hell I'm doing, if we're being honest. Um, I might be this far. You know, I, I genuinely don't remember. I'm looking for, I'm, I imagine that I'm looking for humans. Because the humans have all the shit. Honestly, I don't even know. Yeah. I, I'm genuinely unaware as to what's going on. But anyway, it's St. Patrick's Day. Uh, when you're watching this, it's not going to be St. Patrick's Day, obviously. Um, it's like that sometimes, but anyway, happy early late St. or happy St. Patrick's Day, but also happy late St. Patrick's Day. Um, I was in Dublin last week, so in honor of St. Patrick's Day, I had me a Jameson ginger and lime that I made myself with my Jameson from Ireland, because I'm that bitch, if we're being honest. Um, wasn't I just down here? It seems that it seems that school is closed indefinitely, which um, I find to be interesting. Uh, I'm unsure as to what exactly I'm supposed to be doing. So there's that. Um, like as far as like with the kids and their needs, I feel like they have lessons that they're going to be doing apparently online every morning. Whether they do them or not is going to be a uh, different story. But as of now, it doesn't seem like I have anything else I need to do, which is fine by me. Um, we'll see how long all this shit lasts. In my opinion, I just imagine we're all just um, panicking, which is fine. Like, we're all just like panic, 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 panic. Which, fuck. Which I don't know why we're all panicking, but we are, and it's fine. People panic. Honestly, what I should have did was just looked at my previous outer world footage and seen um, what exactly it is I need to do. And to be honest, I am going to do that. So there's going to be like a weird, like, cut of some sort, maybe. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. Well, wait. What's up here? I haven't been up here before, I don't think. Have I? Oh, what is this? Let's open this talking door. Managers. Oh, messages. They're just messages. I need the chief guy's, like, key to get that logic module. Because once it's done, I'm imagining it's, once it's, once I'm out of this place, that's it. Maybe. Okay, I don't know. So, we're going to be, this going to be a weird cut, and then I'll be back. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll figure it out. It's fine. It's totally fine. Okay, I found this man with the gun. I'm going to take their shit. I'm going to, had to low-key look this up to figure out what was going on. I'm carrying too much shit pressing the wrong button. So I guess I am in the right place. I feel like I wasn't in the right place for some strange reason. Um, we're gonna break this down because I don't need it. I feel like I was in the wrong place. But I guess I was this far. I guess where my last part ended is not where this was. So I'm just really confused. But we're here now. Things happen. We keep it pushing. Taking all this shit. Because we need all of it. Level six. Turn up. Let's take all of it. Cool. Um, we're gonna go upstairs and um, 
anything else in here I need? Oh, let's first do this. I really like persuading. Oh, wait. Hold on. Oh, okay, it's over 50. I see. I feel like I want this to be 50. I can't. Okay, I won't. Actually, how do I reset? Okay, try again. We got 50 on this one. And then... Let's take my tech up. Because it's kind of low. I don't know what kind of character this is at this point. We're just hoping for the best. I'm sure I can probably respec somehow. Oh, we have perk points too. Never gonna be alone. Walk speed? Hmm. So ammo stock, base armor rating, carrying capacity. Oh. Hmm. Oh, more experience from companion kills? We're gonna take this one. This makes the most sense in my opinion. Oh shit, did I not? Jeez. Cool, cool, cool. Um, what is this? Find the three volumes. You found the first volume in the geothermal plant. Oh, so I did this one. I had to return to Luke Wig and need to divert power. So we're going to give power to these people. I probably shouldn't, but... Adelaide is going to have to take an L. I don't want to give Adelaide, I don't want to take the power away from Adelaide, but I've already taken the power from her somewhere else. Um. Wait. Okay. Redirect power to Edgewater. Matter of fact, before I do, before we do that, <laughs> let's save the game. Oh shite! Did I lose my? Oh, I was gonna scream if I got rid of. See, this is my other save with all my other stuff in it. Okay, let's redirect power to Edgewater for once. Let's see what this. People would have suffered otherwise. People I care for, even if they didn't care much for me. Great. Convince the deserters to return. Easy enough. Have persuasion skills. We can make it work. Don't you think? I'm very persuasive in my own right. Maybe. This is actually really good. I'm gonna be a bartender, I've decided. I might as well be at like a ritzy like location. Cause I get more tips. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I feel like I have I have seen, it's been a while since I've played this game. I've kinda of forgot the premise of it. I know it's a pretty much like a attack on um Co uh, communism, <laughs> capitalism, which I think is funny. Can you climb? It's fine, we don't need to climb. We're just gonna go to the map. We're gonna fast travel over here. What's your face gonna be mad as hell, but you know. Wait. I say, bitch, if you don't fast travel. Who's gonna be fighting? Oh, what is this? A plasma cutter? Slices, dices, cauterizes. Okay, how do I get one? So I can just zoom, 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 zoom. You know what I'm saying? Just zoom, zoom. Like a Jedi sword master. No, just me. Yeah, that's that's fine. I'm surprised at how light this. It just tastes like ginger ale. That's that's the kicker. If it just tastes like juice or something, you should probably run away. I'm just saying. These poor people, this poor town, I like ruined their whole lives. Well, they'll be fine. Just come back home. How the f how in the all oh, these holy how the fuck do I get in here? Oh, 
We're going the back way. That's the thing about growing old. Your eyes start to fail. Elsewise, I would have seen you for the snake that you are. Chopped you into pieces and roasted you on a spit. Adelaide, darling. This is all you're doing. Cutting off my power, killing off my garden. Without refrigeration, my food will spoil and my flock will starve. Hmm. I want to ask you this in private, away from the eyes of my flock, so they do not see me lose my temper. Tell me, why did you? Because I can. You want my flock wasting their lives in that cannery? Fine. Go and talk to them. Go talk to Grace and Thomas. Look them in the eye and tell them their life here is over. And the only thing left to do is go back to Edgewater. This is now your responsibility. And you tell Reed Thompson that I will never return to Edgewater. I would rather die among my flowers than live under his management. I'll deal with Reed. You offering to cross Reed off, huh? This some sort of twisted reparation for what you've done? Or are you just looking for a chance to sow some chaos? Kill Reed if you must, or talk him into leaving if you can. He and I are not sharing the same four walls together. My son worked in that cannery. When the plague started coming, he was one of the first to fall sick. We had a store of medicine locked away, but Reed refused to treat him. Said my boy didn't deserve treatment. Said the medicine would have been wasted on me. So I buried my boy in the cemetery, gathered my belongings, and left. That's as much of the story as you need to hear. Well, that's sad. Tell Reed that I can make his people healthy again. I can end their plague. Start a new garden right in the cannery. Three square meals for every man and woman in Edgewater. Tell him how I've made the veil bloom again. The soil has whispered its secrets to me, and I alone know how to breathe life back into the earth. The secret is human corpses. I've been grinding them up in my fertilizer for years. Marauder, worker, don't matter much to me. The human body is rich with nutrients. That's disgusting. But you know... That's disgusting. If I were in a better mood, I might be inclined to try and change your mind. That's disgusting. That's that's fucking disgusting. What's wrong with this bitch? So when y'all die, she uses your you know what? I don't know what you did to talk some sense into Zoe, but I appreciate it. The matter's been weighing on me. Zoe came back, but I couldn't keep her from slipping out in the first place. Who's to say I could keep marauders from slipping in? I don't see us lasting more than a couple of weeks out here. I'm loath to admit it. We're gonna have to make our peace with Thompson and hope he takes us back. Listen, we go back to Reed, hat in hand, begging for our old jobs back. Well, Adelaide's not going to forgive us. She never talked to us again. Sure. Suit yourself. I'll be here. Okay, so, um... Oh, shit. Let's, um, go back here to Edgewater. Convince What's-His-Face to step down. Uh, hopefully he agrees, because otherwise we're going to have to lay some hands. I will kill him and take the power back to Edgel, or the botanical garden thing. 23rd century? Are we even going to make it that far? Crowing out here, killing people, everybody freaking out. 
My job is closing, definitely. I'm still getting paid, though, so that's exciting. I'm... I like I don't know what to do with my life. I could be doing so many things, but I just don't want to do any of them. Like I could I could do all the laundry. I could, you know, become a maid in my own house and just clean every little thing until it's like super clean. But like I don't feel like doing any of that. I kind of just want to do nothing. And so that's what I'm doing kind of. It's just nothing. Is she in here? Let me save my game again because y'all be straight tripping. Oh. Mm -mm -mm. I saw a speed run in this game that was like 11 minutes and I just thought that was wild. Lucky here, sir. This is a fine day, friend. Power flows through our town like a cool stream of water. I trust Adelaide's people have seen their way to reason. So, when can I expect them back at their post? Never. Then we are at an impasse. Stewardship over this town has been entrusted to me by Spacer's choice. I am not perfect. I have made my share of mistakes. But I have done my best for this town. I'm a spacer's choice man. My father was a spacer's choice man. Edgewater may not look like much to some buttoned up freelancer, but it is my home. Mm hmm. I don't believe you. Plague's a reality of life. Best treatment is a good work ethic. <laughs> Have you people ever eaten an actual vegetable? The very notion is just grotesque. A raw vegetable? Why don't you just ask me to go chew the bark off of a tree? We are a spacer's choice saltuna cannery. We eat saltuna here, and only saltuna. I don't understand. You say Adelaide's growing her own food. But that should not be possible. The soil's gone sour. Company said as much. Our own botanists couldn't grow decent crops for us. So the company got rid of them and shut down the greenhouse. <laughs> Alice found a way to grow food. You will excuse me for being skeptical. How exactly is Adelaide growing crops in barren soil? Don't worry about that. If Adelaide's found a way to feed her people beautiful play, then she deserves this office more than I do. I won't stand in the way. My life here is ended. Give me a little time to settle my affairs. I'm sure Adelaide will be glad to see the back of me. What are your plans? A couple months ago, I might have put in for a transfer. It's a big colony. Spacer's choice has other towns. Now, I couldn't show my face in any of them. Why not? No such thing as an honorable resignation. Suppose I could find a place outside the walls or put in for early retirement. Yeah, maybe. I have always tried to do right by my town. It has never been easy. I do. Adelaide's found a cure for the plague. And she knows how to tend to crop. She's what this town needs. Take care. Can we open this door, though? I'm about to pickpocket the fuck out of this man. Okay, keep him quiet. Well, how the hell do I... Where is this damn key card, man? Man, do I have to kill you to get your key card? Cause I'm not trying to kill you for your damn key card. I told you I'm leaving. Just give me a little while to collect my thoughts. Okay. Oh, that was a. Uh... We still win. 
We persuaded him to leave. Allie's gonna come in with her, you know, corpse food, which I feel like is probably gonna be more problematic in the long run, but, um, you know, we're here now. I mean, um, how do I... It is what it is. Look, you gotta do what you gotta do sometimes to survive, and in this case, it means eating vegetables with that are made with corpses, you know? But... Here we are. Titus and Joydicus with Burbage 2000 and Burbage 3000. A new original masterpiece from the director of Agent Khan, an Island of Murder, Blood and Revenge, and Hammering in His Head. I love how it's like, it's like a, what do we call them things? A wig? If so, it's kind of off-putting. It's so fucking dark, man. Y'all yeah, might not have power, but... But, you can take over. What's your weird ass? Look at that. The snakes come back. Bit. I never thought I'd see the day that Reed Thompson abandoned his post. Suppose we all have a breaking point. Suppose it's time our flock made our way back to Edgewater. We must tend to what remains of the town and carry on with our lives as best we may. Cool. You're vexing to me, you know? Injuring us with one hand, helping us with the other. Here, I'm giving you something to leave us be. It's a ransom, you understand, not a reward. The board would decrease. You're telling me you did all this just to put me in charge of Edgewater? Yep. Stranger, you are some kind of twisted. But did it? Uh... I might turn that old cannery into a garden. Got ourselves a whole cemetery bursting with bodies. I need yeah. some time to gather my personals. Long walk back to Edgewater. Got a considerable burden to carry. Cool. Look at that. Somehow I feel like capitalism still wins. But um, we're here now. What is this? Retrieve the power? Oh. Where the fuck is the power? Oh, it's fucking so down here. Okay, let's take this power regulator. I guess I could have just stolen it the first time, but it's fine. Look at God. Before we turn to the unreliable, I want to go here and see if I can... Honestly, I should have just killed him. Like, just punched him one good time in the face. I didn't want to kill Reed, though, but I need his key card to get that volume for a homeboy. I'm trying to not have any, like, um, side missions left alone because, yeah, I want all the experience. Armor is the damage incoming bullet for fast weapons and. Oh, okay. Just talking about me. This game kind of reminds me of Borderlands, but. With talking options, you know? Crouching? I said crocheting. <laughs> what am I? What's the world coming to? Okay, we're back. Let's see if I can get inside of here. I don't know, just... I kind of um, I kind of prefer this choice, if we're being honest. As opposed to the one where you take their power away. Because there's really no point... And like taking the power away from this place if I could convince what's her face to stay here. Granted, I did look up that option because I was trying to get my ass this fu You know what, Reed? You're about to. You know what? He. He. I don't want to kill this man. Oh, what is this? Dude, read my man. If I if I shoot you, oh, it's fine. It's fine. Anyway, in the next part we're gonna. I don't know if gonna handle it now. This Ludwig thing. Let's just get it out the way, and then after we do that, we're gonna do the next part and go to the unreliable, and then um, go to the next part of the game. 
Yes, apparently Ludwig is this way. I really hope he's this way and it's not just, you know, a random door that takes him to the outside, but on the other side. I also wish that it, that it changed location, like, on its own. But also I'm glad it doesn't. Anthracillin? Wow. <laughs> but who just carries that with them, though? Like, if, you know what, it's fine. I guess in this day and age you kind of have to, right? Otherwise, you're fucked. You gotta make it work for you. Which is, uh, very fair. These little screens have not gotten any... See? It put me back over here. Jesus. Oh, Jesus, man. Like, I don't got time for this shenanigans. Like, I, I just need y'all to put me where I need to go. This does not look like this. Why are they lying? Maybe it does from the other side. As long as we do can be here. <laughs> Contact space for choice for your affordable marketing options. Interesting. Is that actually a thing? Like I, like I wonder. I'm also worried that my desktop audio isn't. Okay, so it is recording. Sir. Ludwig, I think he's, I think Lud, I think Ludwig's door is over I'm here. Pretty low, I'm pretty sure it's over here. Yeah, it's over here. It's on the other side. This is the right door. I don't know why I don't just give you the right door, but it's fine. At least I think this is the right door. We'll see. Ted Corporation joined together and formed the Halcyon Holdings Corporation and by the rights of the Halcyon system. They sent out their first colony ship in the late 23rd century. When most of us were stuck and stranded and trapped. And now here we are. But you know what? It's cool. It's fine. You know, I want to be... Train! Jeez, man. I want to be here no way. And now we're... And now we're back. Okay, let's talk to Ludwig. Not von Beethoven, because, you know, he's dead. But this one, this one right here is alive. He's always standing here. Never seen the veil lit up like this before. Bang up, work soldier. You're a credit to your uniform. Oh, that reminds me. Gotta look into getting us a uniform. Cool. So this is it, then. The key to humanity's victory over the mechanical horde. I would reward you with the gratitude of the resistance, but I'm guessing you want something tactile. So here's a couple bits for your trouble, and a little something to remember me by. Cool. Alright, well with that, we're going to end this part right here. Like, comment, and subscribe. Share with all of your friends. Uh, be safe during this time of quarantine and panic. Um, don't overstock on toilet paper because I kind of need some and I'm going to be running low soon. So, uh, that's exciting. Oh, God. Anyway, I love you all. Make good choices. Do your schoolwork if you have any. Um, be nice to your parents. The fuck? Be nice to your parents. Um, you know the drill. I'm not this bitch. Oh, shite.